What's up squidgy slingers and water fed pole wiggling wagglers and welcome to the Tradman YouTube channel and today yes indeed we're talking about what's the best applicator we're going to look at the top five best selling applicators and decide which one's best once and for all stay tuned So yes indeed folks, today we are looking at the top five best selling applicator sleeves and we're going to run through things like water retention, so how much water it actually will hold, scrubbing power, price. So let's get right into it. The first thing we're going to do is a water retention test. So we've got a little thing experiment set up for you so you can see exactly how much water these sleeves really hold and which one performs best. So let's go over to our experiment area. Okay then folks, so here is the test that we're gonna do on how much water these applicators actually hold on to. So it's a very simple test. We've got one bucket here with clean water in it. We've got another bucket here which is completely empty and this little plastic doodad which is gonna hold our applicators for us. So very simply, what I'm gonna do is dunk the applicator into the water, then put it on this little tray let it sit for a total of three minutes. Don't worry, I won't make you watch that. This is gonna be uh, sped up. I'm gonna start the timer on the phone here, and then whatever water is in this bucket will then get poured into this jug here. And basically, long story short, the applicator that wins is the one that actually holds on to the most water. So the lower this number is, the better. If it's a really high reading, then, well, it didn't hold on to much, did it? So let's get cracking. We're gonna start with the Unger Ninja and see how much water these actually hold. So let's get going. Okay then, so who won in the battle of the water holders? So in last place was the Eteray Pro Glove Sleeve. That let go of 425 millilitres of water into our jug at the end. So Eteray grabs last place. So, well done I guess. Next up was the Fire Blade. That let go of 400 millilitres into the jug. So there you have it, the Fire Blade. Next up after them was the Unger Monsoon. That let go of 350 millilitres of water. So there's the Unger Monsoon. So the moment of truth, who bags first and second place? 
Well, would you believe it, in the battle of the water retention, it's actually a joint first place between the Unger Ninja and the Mormon applicator microfiber sleeves. They both let go of 300 milliliters of water into the jug exactly. So they both held just exactly the same as each other. So a joint first place for water retention, Unger Ninja and the Mormon sleeve. So the next thing you're going to be interested in is the scrubbing power of the applicator sleeves. Now this one, this award goes to the Unger Ninja. Now after using all the other sleeves for quite some time, I did find the Unger Ninja was much better at scrubbing on the glass and you've got the added bonus of it's got an extra scrubber on the end. So most sleeves will have just one scrubber whereas this one actually has two. So that's an extra little boost for you. So this one wins on the scrubbing power as well. Right, so the next thing we have to consider is price. So what we're going to do is we're going to run from the cheapest up to the most expensive. So let's get right into it. The cheapest one was the Ettore Micro Sleeve was the cheapest, coming in at £9.66. You'll have to convert that if you live in a different place. So £9.66 for the Ettore Sleeve and well that probably explains why it doesn't hold much water. So the next one, which was the Unger Monsoon Sleeve, this one came in at £12 and 6 pence. Next in line was the Mormon at £12.54 pence. The second most expensive was the Fireblade coming in at £13.32 pence. And the most expensive was the Unger Ninja coming in at £14.04. So the other thing that might be of interest is also how to clean them. Now most of them will say they can take around about 500 washes in the washing machine. But personally what I actually do is use a pressure washer to clean mine. So usually at the end of each week um, I'll pop it on a clean surface, use a pressure washer and just go over it and that really gets out all the ingrained dirt out of the applicator. I'll leave a link up at the top of the video to a video I did actually on using the pressure washer and you'll see for yourself the difference in using something like that. So there you go, So machine washable in the washing machine 500 times roughly according to the manufacturers you can get out of them or you can use a pressure washer. So what's the final verdict then folks? Well basically what we've found out is that the best one really to go for is the Unger Ninja. Now why is that? Well, although you're paying ever so slightly more, what you're going to get in return is a better scrubbing power on the glass. You're going to get a better water retention. It's going to hold on to that water a lot better than the other ones. The only one that came close was indeed the Mormon applicator, which actually held just as much. But unfortunately, the Mormon sleeve doesn't have the same scrubbing power as the Unger Ninja. And you've got that added bonus as well as you've got two scrubbers on the Unger one as opposed to the rest. So if you're looking for the best sleeve on the market, I would highly recommend going for the Unger Ninja sleeve. It's absolutely fantastic. And this is the one I always try and recommend to people. So hopefully you've enjoyed today's video, folks. Thank you very much indeed for tuning in. Been much appreciated once again. If perhaps the sleeve that you really enjoy using wasn't featured in today's video, please comment in the box below. Let me know what sleeve that you really enjoy using and why that would be absolutely awesome. Remember to smash that thumbs up button, it'd be awesome, super cool, and subscribe if you can. And until next time, you take care, be good, and bye for now.